welcome you to my channel today in Hot Topics. I'm going to talk about a friend of mine who's on Facebook who who said something that I, I don't like. I don't like what this person said. I don't agree with what this person said. Um, this person said that they will not support Trump supporters and that they will block them because they voted for Trump and they call that racist. That's not being racist. That That is freedom of choice. Everybody has the choice to choose what they want. I have people in my life that choose things I don't agree with, but I deal with it. I know it's their choice. They have the right to choose what they want. And to say that somebody chooses something different from you is racist is just stupid. I'm just going to flat out say it. It's stupid. To me, you're stupid if you think that because they voted for Trump and you didn't, that they're racist now. No, they're not racist. It's a freedom of choice. My mother voted for Trump. I don't have any issues with her. When it comes to that, anyway. I don't have any issues with her. She's my mother. I'm not going to, like, disconnect from her just because she voted for Trump. That's just stupid. I'm not going to do that to any of my family members, any of my friends, because it's just stupid. To me, you're just being closed-minded. And you're not wanting to be with people who share different opinions than you. Apparently. That's what I think. Again, these are my personal opinions, so I'm, I hope I don't get hate, but if I do, oh well. <laughs> these are my personal opinions. This is what I think this person is doing is wrong. I don't agree with it. You should not isolate yourself like that from people who might have a different opinion than you do. For me, I'm not going to isolate myself from people because they didn't vote the way I voted. They had a choice who to vote for. They voted for Trump. He is now our president. Get over it. I didn't vote for Trump, but I'm dealing with it. He's our president now. I'm giving him a chance here, so give him a chance. That's all I'm saying. But for somebody to say, this is the words they put. I will block you if you are a, a Trump supporter. Because apparently that's racist to this person. It's not racist. It's not racist to say I have the right to choose what I want. To say that because you are a Trump supporter, you're racist. No. Racist has nothing to do with freedom of choice. That is not right. I don't think this person should be saying this because then they're going to isolate themselves. To only a small number of people that will talk to them. Because I will block you if you are a supporter of Trump, basically is what they said. That's just isolating yourself, man. You don't want to isolate yourself from people who might have different opinions of you. I don't isolate myself from people who have different opinions. I can't talk, apparently. <laughs> um, I don't isolate myself from like, they have different opinions. Okay, cool. I'm definitely not going to isolate myself from them because I like talking to people who might have different opinions. I might learn something. I like learning things constantly. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I like having people have different opinions from me. I don't I'd say that you're a racist because you didn't choose to vote for somebody like I did. It's not racist. You're just being stupid. And if you don't like me calling you stupid, just, well... My opinion. I have a right to it. I have a right to say what I want to say. I have a right to choose what I want to choose. I'm not going to block anybody because they didn't vote the same person as I did. I'm not going to do that. It's just stupid. It's closed-minded. It's just not right for me. This is not right, period. You shouldn't be isolating yourself because they didn't vote for someone like you did. It's just stupid. I find it hysterical. Kind of. I do. I kind of find it hysterical that this person is going to block everybody who is a Trump, a Trump supporter. And they also said, block me if you are a Trump supporter. It's like, really? 
The only reason I would block somebody and I would end communication is if they were bullying me in any kind of way, putting mean, nasty comments on my Facebook feed, anything like that. So, yeah. I'm not going to say, oh, I'm not going to be friends with you because you didn't vote like I did. Well, that's just stupid. It's just stupid. I don't understand why people would do that. Was it, I'm not going to be your friend because you didn't vote the same way I did. It's just, please, let it go. Trump is the president. Give the man a chance. I'm giving him a chance and I didn't even vote for him, so. I didn't like the things he said when he was running for office, but now he's president. Let it go. I still see, like, stupid shit on the news um, about people attacking other people because they were Trump supporters. Really, y'all? <clears throat> y'all are going to be that stupid? <clears throat> and y'all are going to attack other people because they, the same thing, they didn't vote with you. You're stupid. Why get in this? To me, it's a senseless fight. It's like if somebody was like threatening your family, something like that I would totally be with you, but you're going to fight somebody because they voted for Trump. Stupid. You're going to go to jail. Is it going to be worth it? Is it going to be worth to tell your jailmates that you got to fight over Donald Trump? A man that you have no business about. A man that is our president and can talk about your sentence time, apparently. He's talking all kinds of shit at this point. I don't know. I just don't pay attention to it. I don't pay attention to people who are going to do something so stupid because their friends did not vote with them. Please, let it go. Just just let it go. <clears throat> you know, it's, it's time to let shit go. I let a lot of shit go. <laughs> That's why I'm so like happy right now because I let a lot of shit go. I'm not letting stupid shit drag me down. Like people saying, that what I do will never become profitable, stupid shit like that. I don't deal with that anymore. For people who talk like that, I have nothing to do with you. I will have nothing to do with people who are negative about what I do, the choices I make. So if you're going to be one of those people that are going to keep harping on what I do and you don't believe it's going to be profitable on what I do, I got no reason to talk to you. I have, I have enough internet trolls to call me all kinds of names. I don't need it from anybody else I know. So, I just let shit go. I let, it, I let it go a long time ago. I had nothing to do with people who say this, what I do right now, is not a job. You're right. It's not a job. It's a business. I'm running a business. I'm running two, actually. <laughs> Depending on how many YouTube channels you have, you're running a few businesses. I'm running this business and I'm running my vlogging channel business, which they're both doing quite well, actually. So for people to put you down because one, you didn't vote for the same person they voted for, let them go. Just let them go. Let them say stupid shit over there because personally, I ain't got time for it. I ain't got time for this stupid drama. Just, just, just stay over there. <laughs> um, I guess the same for people who want to put me down because they don't agree with my choices. They don't agree with what I'm doing for a living. You can just sit over there. I ain't got time for it. So that is going to be it. It's kind of like a little rant, but it needed to be said because I saw it and I just couldn't let it go. Because I think it's wrong. And when I see something that I think is wrong, I'm going to say something about it. That's who I am as a person. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe for more. And don't forget to come over and check out my vlogging channel. It will be up in the bubbles up here and also in the description down below. That you can come and you can check out my vlogs where I just take you around in my daily life. I, I show you what's going on. I don't, I don't just tell you what's going on. I show you what's going on, which is even better. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope to have a cross-stitch world speed pattern out this week. I'm still waiting on my screen recorder to work. 
Thank you guys so much, and I will see you again real soon. Thank you.